You know, it's interesting now we have this opportunity to get genetic testing and BRCA has obviously become one that people know a lot more about or at least hearing about. And so um, the question says, you know, becomes, you know, so what if I test positive? Then what? Um, there are a couple of things. First of all, do make sure that multiple family members get tested. And what I mean by this is women aren't the only carriers, so are men. It's just that they don't have ovaries, right, and they don't have breasts. So um, it's really important that the men in the family also get tested because it can go it can go down both sides of the family. The other piece is the next thing you really should do is make sure that you meet with a genetic counselor. I can't advise you as to what the best thing is for you, whether you want to have a prophylactic surgery or not, or you want to look at other risk reduction opportunities. But it's very important that you sit with a genetic counselor and go through what the options are at that point and what they might be in the future. So again, just make sure that both sides of the family get tested and then make sure that you have the support through genetic counseling to make decisions that are right for you and your family. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I wanna share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.